First up, the gear requirements, okay? When you do video production, you need gear, okay? So I'm going through the list, so it's easy for you. So you can slowly build up your production value. Now, first thing you need is a, a what? A camera. Don't have to be an expensive camera. Everyone this day has a mobile phone. So start from there. A microphone, a camera, a microphone. When you first start out, the best thing to do is get a lovely mic. Get a cheap lovely mic like I'm, what I'm wearing right now. Okay, right now I have, I have two going on right here. And that's to get you started in video production. The trick is get it close, the microphone as close to as possible to your mouth. Then you, your audio should sound very fantastic. Okay, that's the key. Now, when you have your own more money, okay, you build up your gear, then the problem with a wide lavalier is what? It has wires, so you gotta deal with people tripping over. So that's why you have a wireless system, like the Roll Wireless Go, okay? But that's later on, when you have outgrown your setup. The most important thing is what? Another external source. The thing here is we want to do a redundancy recording. You cannot just rely on just your camera and your microphone alone. You need two backup, right? So what I recommend is a Zoom H1N, the one that I'm using right now, the one right here. Uh, actually, I had that years ago when I first started video production. Okay, so around 10 years ago. That's when I have, have this. And I still, can, I still can use it now. Bang for the box for the, the thing that you get, the Zoom H1N, the, the updated version is better value. And guess what, with the Zoom H1N, there's a headphone jack, okay? So you can monitor what you're doing. That's a plus right there, just to get that Bravo. headphone jack. So you can monitor your recording. And of course, you need a steady shot, right? So you need a tripod. Any tripod will do. If you don't have your, a tripod, use a cardboard. Okay, to level up your your camera so it's you know, in level with your eye line. Okay, so use boxes. What I like to use is a tabletop tripod and you can adjust my micro adjustment to, to it. So that's the reason why I like the tabletop tripod. One must have, it's not that expensive either. The light kit. Right now I'm using window light. When you first start out, that is what you have to start with. I'll use natural light, go outside, you're good to go. Okay, but in the long term, we have to think about lighting and that is when you buy additional gear for that. But right now, just you know what kind of light source are you using. Don't use back light, okay, no good. Use side line or front line. So right now I'm using side line, the window just here. So the light is hitting there, right? Beautiful. And there's a shadow here, because I'm a guy, I can use this kind of lighting. But for a ladies, from the window, so the window is right there, you face the window. You are between the window and the camera. And that's to create a backlight. And that's just no good. Nobody can see your face. Now the key is the budget to suit your needs. Video production is expensive. The budget for any big Hollywood production is what? To start with is 50 million roughly to a high-end production value of a movie, a feature movie, 50 million. Now, as a content creator, YouTuber, myself, we have to start out as minimum as possible. So, and you slowly build up your gear. 